Hello folks, welcome. So in this video, we'll talk about uh, FastAPI, which is a uh, Python's uh, framework uh, used to develop APIs mainly. So let's see some of the key features of uh, FastAPI. So these are the key features. It's um, very high performance and fast to code, fewer bugs, and it has a great editor support and uh, easy to implement and learn takes very less time compared to any other uh, you know python uh, frameworks and um, it's robust and uh, it's based on uh, open api standards so when we come to the performance so this is the um, comparison of uh, frameworks so here we have all go frameworks on top because it's a compiled language so that should be on the top so coming to fast api it's uh, at 10th place so if we compare the other frameworks like goframe jin and chi so these are all uh, go frameworks but if we, ca we we can see that like fast api is a uh, above the all uh, other go frameworks and it comes when we compare it with the uh, python frameworks like django and flask flask which is very better so yeah let's get started with the development um let me take you to the vs code and now let's create a file i mean before that uh, we just need to install the fast api and uh, the server you be gone Let's do that. Pip env install fast api uv con Okay, so now we got that and let's create a file. and let's open that from fast api import fast api and let's create the app fast api and let's create a route let's create a simple route which says hello and okay at app dot get and let's say it says hello it doesn't take any input params let's return the simple message statement message hello let's save this i think we need to give one more line here okay so we need to activate the environment so let's do that with env shell now we have activated the environment okay already activated not sure okay now we got the environment and uh, let's run python uv con main and app Let's run it with reload option. Okay, let us type on. So now we are able to run the fast API. Let's open the uh, URL. So here we can see that the detail is not found. That's because we didn't have a route. This one. Okay. So now we have added the uh, route. Hello. Let's try to access that. Let's go back to chrome again and then access that so we can see that message which says hello so this is how we uh, create a simple route a uh, get endpoint so fast api comes with the automated documentation so which helps uh, you know developers to not to write any other documentation so let's so it 
uh, we can see the docs by uh, accessing the route docs so let's click on that so here it comes with the simple uh, parameters it doesn't take any parameters and uh, the expected response is, is 200 and uh, so when we click on try it out and then we click execute so yeah we can see the response body and uh, all response headers so we also have a, a redoc documentation for this in order to access that we just need to access the route redoc so yeah so it's a inbuilt documentation for all apis and we can um, try the documentation as well i mean by hitting the endpoints docs so it's that simple to get started with the fast api